On a little island nestled in the sea, legends of pirates and treasures grew. But as two adventurous mice were to discover, the value of treasure is found by the holder. Help! Oh, help! Oh, you're gonna walk to Gangplank and I'll get your treasure! Oh, <laughs> oh, Mavis, you're supposed to be scared. Sorry, Sweeney. Help! Please, someone help me. Unhand that maiden, you fiend. Else you'll suffer the wrath of Eckert the Heroic. Release her and her treasure. Or face Bridget the Fearless. Arr! 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 <laughs> what do you think you're doing? Rescuing the damsel in distress. Well, you can't. I'm Eckert the Heroic. So? I'm Bridget the Fearless. Well, there can't be two heroes. You're afraid to let anyone else be the hero because they might be better than you. Afraid? I'll show you who's a hero. Will you now? <laughs> Arr! I will! Oops. I guess we should go. It's true, isn't it, Grandpa? The pirates used to come here and leave treasures buried in the sands. Oh, don't believe everything you hear, boy. Or you'll be more filled with fables than facts. You don't believe it? When I was a boy like you, I spent many an hour searching for treasure. Did you ever find one? I did find a treasure in Crumfest Coal, the most valuable treasure there is. Even made a map so we could find it again. But... But what, Grandpa? Hmm. But the treasure's gone, and never to be found. That's enough talk about treasures. Grandpa? Do you think it's still there? Do you? Eckhart, I said that's enough. The young mouse knew enough to stop asking, but that didn't stop him from thinking. Should we be doing this? Shh, we're doing this for Grandpa. It's his treasure. What are we looking for anyway? You'll see. Bingo! You're the one who shouted. What'd you find? I've seen Grandpa open this box and just look inside. What's in it? Not here. Let's go. Coast is clear. Thanks, sweetie. Now, let's see what this box holds. What is it? Oh, it's a map to the treasure. Are you sure? Of course. Look, a message. Beneath a tall tree, on the edge of the sea, lays a treasure more precious than gold. This is it. It sounds like there's something missing. There's nothing missing. This is the map to Grandpa's treasure in Crumfest Cove. <laughs> the boss is gonna love us. <laughs> Why is he gonna love us? Because you drained brain, that map is gonna lead us to treasure. Oh yeah, that's good, right? Of course it's good, don't you know anything? I know we'd better get that map, or we won't get no treasure. <laughs> Look, it's torn on the bottom, like there's more to the message. There's enough for me. Once we get to Crumfest Cove, I know I can find it. There you go, doing it all by yourself again. Haven't you ever heard of teamwork? <gasps> Quick, turn around! Hey, what are you doing? I am copying the map out for the boss. But that's my back! No, it's what you call being resourceful. <laughs> it's what I call itchy. Draw a little more in the middle, will you? Ah. <laughs> Look out! They're copying your map! <gasps> Come on, let's go! We are gonna be heroes! <laughs> heroes is good, right? 
Yes, you insufficiency of intellect. Heroes is very good. <laughs> nice. Very nice. We're heroes, right, boss? Get that treasure, and then I'll decide who's a hero. Great, boss. Come on, Shorty. Aren't you forgetting something? Uh, no. No! Uh, what, boss? Y yes. Treasure, hunting, equipment. Uh, sure, boss. Right away. Uh, just one thing. What exactly is treasure hunting equipment? No, no. Shovels, picks, rope, pulleys. What's a pulley? It's the opposite of a pushy, you boob. <laughs> Never mind. Just get it. Right, boss? Take it to Crumfest Cove, Winnie. I'm taking Farmer Walker there to dip for clams. You come along for the ride. Thanks, Winnie. But you have to promise to be careful and be sure to leave before the tide comes in. I know enough to leave in time. Well, just in case, I'll need three times when the tide starts rising. Okay? Okay. Hurry up, hurry up. Sure thing, boss. Uh, 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 Here, let me get that. Oh, ow, 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 ow. Oh, um. oh you. Dunderheads! Oh no! Look! Oh, they don't stand a chance of beating me to the treasure. Get up! And so the young mice went on their quest to find treasure, their hearts racing in anticipation of all they'd imagined. Don't forget, three nays. Okay, okay Winnie. Winnie. Good luck. Thanks. Thanks. We can get our bearings there. Okay, let's look at that map. We start right here. What makes you think that? This is where a pirate would start. Oh, yeah? You wouldn't know a pirate if you sat on one. Oh, yeah? Well, you wouldn't know what either. Ah! Who are you? Caleb's the name. Are you a pirate? I might be, or I might be worse. <laughs> are you going to make us walk the gangplank? <laughs> what would be the point of that? So you could get our treasure map. Great, now he knows we have the map. Where did you get this? Um, it's my grandpa's. I'm gonna find his treasure. Yar, are you? Well, you won't get far without this. See, I told you the message wasn't finished. Look! Beneath a tall tree on the edge of the sea lays a treasure more precious than gold. If you look for the key, and let your eyes see, the treasure will surely unfold. Look, the bottom's torn. Like there's another part. But it still doesn't tell us any more than we already knew. Where'd you get this? <gasps> Where did he go? He kind of gave me the creeps. Speaking of creeps, look. Well, which way? Um, <laughs> it's either that way or... That way. 
Oh, why couldn't I have flunkies with brains? Yeah, but if we had brains, we wouldn't be flunkies, would we, boss? No, oh, just shut up and be a map. Okay, okay, now I'm sure. It's definitely that way. Look. That's it! Beneath a tall tree, on the edge of the sea, Idiot! Hmm, I must have drawn a map upside down. I got it! Shorty, stand on your head! Yeah! Never mind! Just get over there and find that treasure! Don't forget me, you don't! <laughs> this is the tree. It's taller. But this one is bigger around, which means it's older. So it was here when the map was made. You can think what you want, but I'm digging under this tree. Why are you being so stubborn? Because it's my grandpa's map, and I say it's this tree. What's this? Trouble in paradise? Hmm. It might be time to divide and conquer. That's the stupidest thing I ever heard, Eckerd Fielding. Well, I've got the shovel, and I'll dig wherever I want. Fine! Fine! It's so much easier to conquer <laughs> when they do their own dividing. <laughs> oh, I've never believed them. Believed who? The one who says Eckhart is the brains of your group? Yeah, I don't think so. Exactly. And now you have a chance to prove we're both right. What do you mean? I've got a shovel. And you know where the treasure is. Sounds to me like the perfect partnership. Partnership? Partnership? Beat it! <laughs> oh yes, you see, I need someone I can rely on. Someone who can think on their feet. And once found, will share in the treasure. What do you say? Partner? Uh. Oh, could it be that they were right and... Eckhart really is the brain. Huh? Partners. <laughs> All right, team, start digging where our new partner Bridget says. Bridget? With Boss Mouse? And I thought she was my friend. Foolish boy. Dig, dig, dig faster. The harder you work, the more you'll appreciate the <laughs> treasure. Oh, Ned. Yep, what? How many times have I told you there are to be no seeds in my grapes? Sorry, boss. Uh, boss. <laughs> There's something I don't quite get about your plan. <laughs> Why did you make her a partner and tell her we'd share all the treasure? It's very simple, Ned. I lied. Ah. Boss, you are a genius. Of course I am. <laughs> get back to work. Ah! You're determined, I'll give you that. Bridge is wrong, isn't she? I thought this was about finding treasure, not about who's right or wrong. Huh? What do you mean? If I find it... If you find it, then what? What do you think could change? My grandpa says it's the most valuable thing there is. He did, did he? Well, I'm telling you that you'll never find this treasure alone. This is a treasure that is best discovered by you and a friend. Bridge is no friend. She betrayed me. And you believe everything you see, do you? <laughs> You'd tell me if I was digging in the wrong place, wouldn't you? Huh? That guy sure is strange. Haven't you found that treasure yet? I don't have all day. It would be faster if you help. Uh-oh. Huh? 
If I want your opinion, I'll tell you. You're the one who said I'm smart. <laughs> smart compared to Eckhart? Not me, you silly girl. Now get back to work. That's... Ow! I hit something. <sighs> the treasure. We found it! Rich. I'm rich, I'm rich! <laughs> You're rich? What about us? <laughs> That's the signal. The tide's rising. I hope Eckert heard it. Oh, forget him. We got what we came for. We can't just leave him there. He could drown. Well, hasn't your tune changed? You weren't so concerned about him a little while ago. That doesn't mean I'm not his friend. Well, go help your little friend. But if you do, you forfeit your share of the treasure. <laughs> oh, no. Sure was close. It wouldn't have been if you'd let me help all along. Help? You betrayed me. I swear, you're just as stubborn as your grandfather. You know my grandpa? No. Thomas and I haven't spoken in years. But that's not the point. She gave up the treasure for you. You did that for me? Well, I couldn't let you drown. I was mad at you, Eckerd, but you're still my friend. Bridget, I... No. This is what I work so hard to find? This is nothing! Fools, you told me there was a treasure! We thought there was, boss. <laughs> Whoa, the box is nice. Ah! Hey, look! It's the same as the other messages. It's the final part of the message. Beneath the tall tree, on the edge of the sea, lays a treasure more precious than gold. If you look for the key, and your eyes let you see, then the treasure to you will unfold. For the love of a friend, who is yours to the end, is the best treasure you'll ever hold. I guess I was kind of stubborn. I didn't really want to join Boss Mouse. I just wanted to prove I was as smart as you. You are. I'm sorry, Bridget. Me too, Eckhart. <laughs> now you get the point. But what I don't get is why you had part of the message. Unless... You and Grandpa buried the treasure! It was our friendship pact. We were to dig it up when we were old. Uh, we had an argument years ago, and that was the end of our friendship. Are you thinking what I am? At last, we agree. He should have been home hours ago. Now, Clara, he can take care of himself. All that foolish talk of pirates and treasures, I hope he hasn't done something silly. Look! It's Eckhart and Bridget. Who's that with them? 
Grandpa, we found your treasure. Eckhart, what have we told you about talking to strangers? He's not a stranger, Mom. He's an old friend. Grandpa, this is Caleb. Caleb, what are you doing here, you old salt? You, you can thank your young grandson for that. I'm not sure if I should thank him or punish him. <laughs> 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 now let's not get into a fight so soon. We've got a few years to catch up on. I'm not fighting. You're the one who starts the fights. Me? Thomas Fielding, you're just as stubborn as ever, and your memory's shot. <laughs> <laughs> and so two young friends discovered their treasure and helped two old friends rediscover theirs. I never thought I'd say this, but... I feel sorry for Boss Mouse. Oh, and how do you figure that? Well, he found the treasure, but he didn't know what to do with it. Aye. Sometimes it takes a keen eye to see what's right in front of you. And sometimes it takes a grandson to show you. Eckhart, just because you brought two old friends back together doesn't mean you're getting wiser than your old grandpa. Yes, sir. But I've got to tell you. You're well on your way. And Eckhart, thanks. <laughs> <laughs>